Kelly. Did you? I was pretty much indoors the majority of the time. Yes. Oh, well, you know. So yes, I got Flu sun. fluorescent sun. Yeah. The sun. You know, what's the difference? They both emit light. I played they Final Fantasy VII, the remake. Yup. That oh, was you did? lit. Yo. I'll tell you about it later. Here we go. Yes, we got uh, Palutena versus Greninja classic set. Gen versus Venia. This could literally go either way. It depends on who's playing See, better today. And just like Final Fantasy VII remake or not, this is a classic. Match. A classic for the ages. One we've seen time and time again. People, oh, yo, that interaction was actually legitimately all that this matchup is. Was that dash attack clanking with that forward air? Dash attack has guard point. I am telling you, mm -hmm. so strong. Very good, absolutely. And Jen knows how to use it to good effect. He doesn't spam it. He doesn't abuse it. But oh, he, he definitely. It. He, he, if you're airborne against Jen, he's gonna throw a dash attack. Yes, that is but, like his mo. But see, the thing is, is it spam if it works every time? That's the real question. I mean, yes, but the, you know, never mind. <laughs> I don't want to get into Fair this. Enough. Fair enough. One sixteen for sixty eight oh. percent. All right, um, it's good spam. Yeah, it's it's good. It's I've had good thoughtful spam. Thoughtful spam. Store. Not all spam. Have you actually ate spam before? Oh uh, no, I haven't. It's pretty disgusting. Is it? Yeah, <laughs> it tastes like soggy sausage. Ew. That doesn't sound very good. No, can't, it's... It, you yeah. can cook Spam, though, can't you? Yeah. It's, it tastes like hot soggy sausage. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Well, just like cook Spam, if you're going to use Explosive Flame, you better make sure you're using it at the right distance there. Otherwise, you're going to get cooked. Yo, he just lost everything off of that. Just because he did that Explosive Flame wrong. He got knocked off the stage, and then he paid for it with his life. I mean, Explosive Flame is a commitment. It is. It is a legit fireball commitment. There's not There's not too many moves in this game that are punishable, if you ask me. I feel like everything's safe. Yes. But that is not one of them. No. No, absolutely. Um, that's why uh, I can't remember who exactly what it was. I think it was Ray, maybe. Might have been Jen. But one of the Palutena's were talking about, like, oh, yeah, Explosive Flame's not a good move. And in a lot of regards, it isn't. It's good at space, but if you're on stage and you use Explosive Flame, you better hope you hit that thing or you could very well be punished, especially by a fast character like I mean, there, there are Palutena's who exclusively exclusively use it when they're off stage because it's yes. free at that point, you know? Yes, absolutely. Might as well eat that resource for free. That's where, it's, that's where it thrives. Mm -hmm. Okay, double Nair. Ooh, big damage coming out from Venia. Mm -hmm. Yo, chases, but he got the teleport cancel. Yeah. He's super good at those. Not the easiest thing in the world to do, and that's why he likes PS2 so much. And then the interesting thing about fighting against Venia mm -hmm. is when you fight against him, he'll let you pick the stage. He doesn't care. Yes. He says he's not afraid to fight you anywhere. Mm -hmm. So I guarantee you, Jen's like, okay, PS2. Yes. Uh, I have fun thing I want to point out really quick, by the way, you see the Olay tag from Venia. He recently got a uh, Vega tattoo, the Vega snake tattoo. You can just see it in his player cam around his arm and just peeking out on his shoulder right there. I thought there was something up, up about him. Yeah, yeah, it yeah. Looks slick. I like it. Yeah, it's pretty good. He got it a couple days though, so he's feeling a bit raw. Um, I wonder if that'll affect how he plays. Right now, he's kind of sitting the stock down, and there's a little bit of fear put right there. You saw Jen run off stage. It looked like he was going to go for a dare, but in actuality, Jen was just seeing how are you going to respond to this. He didn't want to risk anything. So he double jumped backwards. Yes. Data downloaded for future. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. One of my favorite things about watching Jen plays. That's what he's like doing. You know. Especially when he has a lead like this, he can afford to give up circumstances. That teleport cancel was super telegraphed. There's nothing else he could have been going for at that point. All right, Forces the flame. jump with the explosive flame. Yep. Actually could have gotten something bigger off of that whiff down tilt right there, but doesn't get a conversion off of it. Okay, Benny needs to close out the stock now. Goes for the nice. back air, catches the warp. Good tech from Jen, able to warp back onto the stage. Okay, Goes it. for the platform drop no, back here. Not enough lives. to get the kill just yet. Still living at 119%. This frog is not fragile. He's more of a toad. He's a little bit agile. See right there. What could he have done that with a one? Yeah. Dash attack. Or explosive oh. flame. You see? Are you sure he's not a frog because he's looking like frog legs right now? He got cooked. Too bad for you. Instantly. Do you cook frogs a lot? No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't. Have know you ever had frog? No, I actually you haven't. You haven't had spam, so, you haven't had frog. So here's the thing. Like, I'm, I'm pescatarian, so all I eat is fish. That's fair. Yeah. Yo, look, see, look at how fast these players are playing. It's almost like watching a different game. Is this really? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, what happened? I couldn't follow any of that stuff. I feel like we should start playing Ultimate on times 2 speed. That would be kind of fun. They actually have, uh, I think it's uh, 500 or 50XX, which is like the quote unquote melee mod for this game where you use spirits and uh, custom smash, which is actually nah. kind of fun. It's sort of jank, though. I feel like they did that in Smash Wii U as well. Yes, that was, um, what was that? That was like Fast Fall, Quick Land or something. Yeah. But it, it didn't have as cool of a name as 50 episodes. 
All right, so taking it to FD on this one. Uh, Venya's counterpick, and I can sort of understand why catching Palutena's landings, while it's not some great weakness of hers, can be a vulnerable point. Especially because uh, Jen, as you said, does really like to go for those teleport cancels, and it's pretty good at them. So taking out that little bit of extra space for Palutena to recover is kind of big. You saw that a lot previously, too, against uh, Jewel as well, especially on Kalos, where he would just recover to the platform if he felt he was being a little too pressured, and he had the space to do so. All right, see Venya doing a lot of these uh, forward airs in the air, trying to catch him, the ledge jumps off the stage, off the ledge. He's hopping a lot, trying to bait us out. Yep. I like when Venya, when Venya goes for these empty hops a bunch of times, that's how you know he's like trying to like scope out something. Yes. He's feeling he, himself a bit. He's got momentum. palatina has got that movement speed too, where she can fake you out very well with that and still commit on a dime. All right. Gets him off stage with the Nair. Uh, doing a lot. Yo, that actually didn't eat the projectile. I didn't know it worked like that. All right. Gets him off stage. Charge Water Shuriken to cover the high recovery. Gave him a Tossums. 140%. Yo! He got the hit stun off that to guarantee that into a grab. That was sweet. Weak slick. hit. That was kind of cool. Dash attack. attack. Dash, Dash attack. attack. Remember, though, Dash Attack, DA for short, uh, DA Venya. It's all Who? conspiracy. DA Venya. Who? Uh, Deadly Alliance Venya. It's all part of the Who? script. Who? Dash, <laughs> Dash Attack Venya. Dash, Dash Attack Venya. Free. Deadly Alliance. Dash Attack DA. I don't know what Deadly Alliance is. The DA. Oh, back oh, here. That's the Dash Attack. Yes. DA stands for dash attack. Yes. There we go. I mean, the thing is, I feel like Jen needs to equip that tag. My man spamming dash attack as well. <laughs> Ooh, he dragged him with the very last See. hit in there. That was slick. Yes. All right. Gets him off stage. See, Venny is not going too hard off stage for uh, an edge guard on this one. And I can understand why. One, because you sort of need to hard read where Jen's going to be, but also because if he gives up this stage, uh, Venny trying to get back against Palutena is sort of scary. Uh, Palutena's got really good ledge game. Right, gets him off. Passes out the explosive flame. Footstool. Yo, that was actually punished on the footstool. Uh oh, let's go for a restand. Nothing off of it, though. Look at all these dash stacks from Benio. The reason he's going for it is because it gives him that free cross up. Yes, free cross up, uh, and it confirms. All right. Dash stack going, yo, he actually go ahead. Yeah, see, he went heavy off there, but now he has to get himself back off stage. Actually, does it without any trouble. Once again, the dash stack coming in clutch to call out that uh, aerial. Yo, he baited it! Wait that was like for a the smash air dodge. four. That was a smash four air dodge. What was bait. that? A dash attack that led into that situation? Yeah, I'm dash attack. Sure. Yeah. There Yo. we go. Venny popped him up into the air, waited for the air dodge, got the forward air, got the kill. And now Venny finds himself with a lead. Looking pretty good. Forward air is a dash attack is another forward air. What the hell did you just say? Don't you ever yawn on the mic again. Oh. I pardon. swear to God, I will smack you. Yep. Uh, he got a forward air into a dash attack into another forward air. Thank you. Yes. You civilized human being. A forward air into a dash attack into another forward air. Okay, so 143% on Venya. Trying to get this uh, this kill. Trying to take this frog down a leg, if you know what I'm saying. Well, honestly, Jen's just struggling to get back onto the stage. Yes. Um, back there. Oh, there back we go. Up, yep. There we go. There's a start. Jen one stock away from moving on to losers finals. Face off against Nick C. Yep, it's a little tough for him to come back, but if he can get the Nair, oh, actually beat him out with the down. And there. right now, this entire tournament up until grand finals is the whole who from New York City is going to try to defend the homeland. That's yes. how we're deciding. We're, we're, yeah, we're winning at this out. point. At this we're point, we're him out to see who's going to defend the homeland. Yes. Yo, that was smart. All right. And Venny wants a shot. Mm -hmm. uh, going into game three, it's. Honestly, up to either of them right now, but Venya looking pretty confident with that game, too. I think not having the platforms there and letting him have a little bit better of a ledge trap uh, game against Palutena without the platforms was a really good idea. Now, Yo. Venya yes. hasn't fought Wishes today, correct? I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure Wishes beat Jen. Yes, he did beat and Jen. And Nick C. He did so beat Nick So, and, and Venya didn't get the opportunity. Yes. So, um, see, that's the thing, though, is that if Wishes, if Venya moves on to Grand Finals and Wishes beats Venya, then that's then how we know we're that, washed. That would be a complete wash. Solidify. Yes. Solidify that I beat all your top players. Get out of here. Absolutely. All right. Good angle on that one. Venya is so good at those angles of, like, going just under so he doesn't get two framed with the Hydro Pump. Mm. I mean, it's, it's pretty easy for him to do that as well because, you know, just naturally, Greninja is always kind of like a short character because he's, like, he's always, like, on his hands. Yes. Because he's a ninja, I guess. Yep. And a toad. I never would have guessed. I guess it's that's what the It's almost as if he's part. a battle toad. A toad that battles. Anywho, 81% uh, <laughs> on Venya. 
Up air. Yep. Now, is he a toad or is he a frog? He's a toad. He's a toad. Is He's he? One thousand percent a toad. Unload the toad. How do you know? Unload the toad right now. In How chat. do you know? One hundred three percent on money. Okay. Yes. Three stocks away, man. Like they're, they're tied for now. We got a lot of uh, stage control coming out from Benny. You see him dashing back and forth on that stage. Yep. Wait, Doesn't get to the control off the dash today. I like that drag down. You see him get him with that nair, drags him down, connects yes. that into the forward air. Nice pivot grab. Catches him completely off guard. Gets the back throw. Sneaks the kill. First stock, first blood going to Jed. Going on a going stop on it, a stop it. I did. I will smack I did. you. I did. Going on a strong uh, first stock against. Uh, Venny right now, uh, but Venny uh, kind of keeping him at the ledge right now. That may be something there that Jen needs right there to get back over there. All right, Falling there. There, there yep. we go. Keep it coming. More Actually, up airs. Yes. Actually, restanded him with the up air as opposed to getting a full connect, which allowed him to go for a chase and pressure on the platform. That's pretty good. Falling off stairs. Uses the hydro pump. Off stairs. Off stage. That's, I mean, he's downstairs, like, trying to go upstairs, all back onto the stage. 77% on Venia. Yeah, yeah, Looking yeah. for this explosive flame. Nice avoidance. You see him go for the double jump, tries to fade away from the explosion. That would potentially put him in a terrible spot. Yo, Couldn't actually, capitalize. now that I think about it, Palutena basically is the force upstairs because Jen's got some kind of god in his corner. If he hasn't died yet at 144 with all these stray hits, the hydro pumps, etc., he's still hanging on. So that hydro pump actually put Jen into a precarious situation. But he wasn't able to connect that down smash right afterwards because that could that should have been checkmate. But we're still living. Waits for the hydro pump before committing to the up B. Doesn't want to get caught off guard. But yep. Venia does so. Go runs right up to him, barrages him with a grab, throw it, tosses him off stage like a rag doll. Okay, we're out spacing, we're out maneuvering. Benny is looking for a neutral at this point, try to get some easy damage in the beginning. Yep, that nair very good. Uh, pretty hard to punish on shield. Cross up. I feel like that dash attack didn't connect into the reverse arrow rush back air because he was at maximum rage. Mm -hmm. Or not maximum, but pretty he, close. He's getting there. He's absolutely high, getting there. High amounts of rage. Yep. Might as well very, is maximum now, very but now he's dead. Very angry frog. Very... <laughs> I'm not going to let it go. So easy. All right. Footstool, Chase. Oh that was actually God. really good awareness. And again, Jen knows that down air is a really good uh, just, just answer with yes. Pal. Whenever he sees a big punish coming in, it, the, you know, the cards play itself right. You easily get some big confirms off of it. And I, I do want to note that uh, if, if you look in uh, Jen's camera right there on the far right, the guy in the red shirt, that's yes. actually Venia's little brother. Oh, he, no joke? He came to the tournament today. Yo! He actually participated in everything. Venio was talking about how he's like trying to teach him out, so he's definitely trying to watch and learn from the best, because right now he's got to put on a show for his bo his boy, dude, his bro. Yep. Uh, honestly, taking it to game three right now, even if he's a stock behind, I still think uh, he's not on the ropes just yet. I think he can still bring it back, and honestly, what better way to teach someone than to show someone that it's never over until it's over? Okay, Venia 100%. Yo, Tomahawk, a little bit of a delayed Tomahawk at that. Dash tried to catch the landing yet again. It gets a back here after dropping through the platform. Nope, not not yet. yet. All right, a little bit. There nice. we go. Yo, Yo, that was chase. a confirm? Was that Jen? a chase or was that a confirm? I don't know, man. My man's going ham, but the problem is he's off stage looking for that explosive flame from Jen. Dash attack. Uh, again, you Beats see him yeah. mashing buttons. Dash attack's going to beat oh. it out. All right, that's it. Yep. Good night. Yes. It's going to be Venia ending out at fourth place here at Xeno 166. But not, you know, he put up a fight. That's what you got to yep. say. It was pretty close till the end. It went to last stock, game three. But now Jen's got to move on to fight off against Nixie once more. Mm -hmm. Jen takes away this set. That'll be the second. That'd be, oh, wait, I'm sorry. If Nick takes this set, that'll be the second time today yes. that'll defeat him. But Jen's looking for that run back. You know. They actually played a bunch of friendlies yesterday. There was Did a they? so uh, Nixie actually hosted a Smash Fest yesterday mm -hmm. and invited a bunch of people over from New York City to play against. I couldn't make it because I was busy with work. I've got you. But uh, and also I wanted to stream <laughs> some Paper Mario. You can catch that twitchtv slash Vista. Yeah. Anyways, um, he was um, playing with other people and Jen was one of them. And so they they play against each other a lot. Whenever Nix tends to host, he always invites Jen and Jen always comes through because Jen's a fiend. Mm -hmm. So those two play against each other a lot, so they know each other's habits, they know each other's play styles, they know each other's thoughts. Sometimes.